Hello, my name is Regine Skillern and I'm Director of Marketing for Cloud Computing and Intel. We've been looking at the microserver segment for a number of years, watching it as an emerging workload in the web hosting environment and some of the front end web and large data centers. And as we've talked to customers, we were trying to understand what they were trying to do. They were trying to drive new levels of cost effectiveness, power efficiency, density, at minimum and holding minimum performance levels for their data center and infrastructure, while also having platforms that had baseline server features such as 64-bit OS support, EC CC, 4 gig memory support so that they had a true data center class infrastructure. And as we heard these requirements, we began investing in the segment to make sure that we had leadership products that hit every design point, um, from the highest performance levels down to the lowest power levels and cost levels. And we've been investing as well, not only in leading edge technologies, but also in delivering standards so that as these platforms come to market, they are done with a way that not only speeds time to market and reduces development costs, but also enables more platforms to enter in the system. And the third piece has been really working with the under e ecosystem to bring these platforms to bear. And we've done that primarily by working with Dell over the last couple of years. Dell has been engaged in the space as long as we have, talking to many of the same customers and, and, and hearing the same requirements. And so we jointly invested in the first DCS platform based on the Intel Xeon platform last year. And we're excited that their new forthcoming PowerEdge C-Class microserver will also embrace the new next generation Intel OneSocket Xeon platform. So watch for upcoming announcements between Dell and Intel over the next few weeks, and we look forward to your evaluations and input on the Dell, Dell PowerEdge C-Class microserver.